Now let's go through a little bit more terminology. Let's talk about the journal, the ledger, and the trial balance. The journal is a chronological record of transactions. Because the journal is where transactions are first recorded into the accounting system, it's often called the book of original entry. Entries recorded in the journal are called journal entries. The ledger, then, is a collection of accounts and their balances. And then finally, the trial balance is a listing of accounts and their balances at a specific point in time. So at the far left of the journal is a column for the transaction date. To the right of the date is a column to record the names of the accounts affected by the transaction and an explanation. The accounts receiving debit entries are listed first, followed by the accounts receiving credit entries, which are slightly indented. To the right of the account names are debit and credit columns to record the monetary values of the transaction. The totals in the debit and credit columns should be the same for each transaction. When, a, when an accounting transaction is recorded in the general journal, we often say that the transaction has been journalized.